Welcome back to Walsh's World, and today I'm going to be having a look at trying to fix the conservatory roof. So it's got a hole in it, I'm trying to show you. I don't know if you can see that. You can see the sky. But um, that panel has just dropped down a little bit and uh, got a little gap, so it's making rain on the table, um, which isn't good. I don't know if you can see that actually. Where's my finger? Oh, there, yeah. So. It's a bit annoying and um, I can't find any videos on YouTube about it so I thought I'd make this one and I will show you. So I'm going to have to go from the outside I think. These panels here don't um, don't seem to come off. I meant securing beams. Go outside and see if we can fix it from out there. Okay, see you in a minute. Okay, we're on the roof. This is a bit precarious. It's very slippy on the slate, so the camera's probably going to slide a few times. Um, but probably. Get away with it. So, what I've got to try and do. Hey, ladders! Uh, ow. Um, Try and make this ladder a bit more secure. Back in a minute. Yeah, perhaps secured my ladder a little bit. That's better. Uh, so what I've got to try and do somehow um, take this bar off. I'll just try pulling on it. Just had to change the camera right, angle so there to avoid a view of my builder's bomb. This one, there's the the gap in the um, in the roofing tile thing. Basically, you just pull it and pull it and pull it, and it and it's unclipped. Um, just clips on all the way down. So you just pull it hard enough, it seems to come off. So yeah, that's good. At least I've got one off. Somehow I need to get the big one off. Now. Sorry about the builder's bomb. It is inevitable on this job. Trying to pull on these securing panels from the middle just doesn't work and you have to start from the very end of the beam. So what I was doing here is pulling it up in the middle and then nearly drop the roof panel into the conservatory, which wasn't good. Right, okay, so I've managed to lift up this panel here, so uh, this beam, this cross beam. So the best thing to do is start at the end and kind of lift it up. And once you lift it a bit, it all lifts. Change that. It all lifts out fairly easily just by pulling it up. And then you can slide the panel back into place. I mean, to be honest, it's probably quite rare that these fall out of place, but for some reason mine have. I'm sure it's happened to someone else. And then all I need to do is put that back by pushing it down. All along. Somehow. I might need to stand on that. Yeah, I've got a mega shaky cam here. It's just really difficult to try and work and hold this uh, tripod in one hand but yeah try my best
I think I'll just literally stand on it to pop it back in like that. That seems to be working. Um, it's a bit hard trying to hold this at the same time. Bear with me a sec. I'll just. So what I'm going to do is drop, drop the other one on top, and then stand on it to. Um, and then I'll slide that. Back on. So yeah, I'm just going to hold that in place with my foot and push it down a bit. That's it. That's it. That's clipped in now, I think. It's a bit filthy. But at least now my panel is uh, is in place. Uh, I probably didn't make that look easy. It's the first time we've ever done it and I've been trying to figure it out as I went along. But um, yeah, thanks for watching Walsh's World. Hopefully, if you've got a slip panel on your conservatory, then you can um, fix it. Thanks a lot. Bye now.